there is tons of Figma plugins out there and let's be honest, not all are actually useful. So in this video I'm gonna show you my recent finds that will actually speed up your workflow. We will go from generating UI in a single prompt to even making a 3D visuals. Let's get into it. The first one is UX Pilot. And honestly, this tool changed how I start every single project. I like to start right on the website, let's say I want to make a weather app for runners. You can pick whether you want to start in a wireframe mode or go straight to final design and choose between desktop or mobile. You can even attach a reference image or even better, you can actually import your Figma component so generated wireframes will use your own style and be consistent with the rest of the product. Then you write your prompt and this can be for a single screen or entire user flow. From there, I can either generate variations of a single screen or even refine my prompt if I want better results. There is also a preview mode or a prototype mode so you can actually click through the flow before sending it anywhere. Once I'm happy with the wireframe or the layout, I just mark it as ready for Figma. Now, here is the cool part. Using Figma plugin, I can import all those generated screens directly into my file. They come into editable frames with all naming sorted. From there, I can either tweak the design or even run a design review. And if you use FigJam, the plugin works there too. You can create UX diagram, flow, or even run workshop without leaving the workspace. It's kinda wild how fast this is. You can go from a simple idea or prompt to fully designed screens in minutes. There is a link in the description if you want to try it out. Seriously, worth playing with. The next plugin might be just for you. And it lets you put any screenshot into editable file. In the last video, I was showing you the plugin that does this for website, but this one does for mobile apps as well. Let's try it. So I'm gonna use the screenshot I took with my iPhone and I'm gonna upload it here. So on the left hand side we have our original screenshot and on the right side we have the recreated version with the plugin. I'm using a free version and I'm gonna say it did a pretty good job. The one thing I've noticed the typography is different. I think Instagram is using the classic iOS and here we have our interfont. Another thing there is a slightly color difference but as I said I'm using a free version. Maybe with pro version is even more accurate. It also comes with a handy design library built in with iOS, Android or web. So you can also check popular apps and then convert their screenshot into Figma editable fire directly. Super handy, it combining few other tools I use already into one. Generating assets usually take a really, really long time. What if I told you you can do them now in one click? So once you get your structure, the next bottleneck is visual. I used to spend hours searching for right icons or generating assets. Now I just describe what I need, like 3D coffee mug or a retro computer. It's like having an instant 3D on your outboard. And speaking of visuals, another plugin I've fallen in love is basically like having an AI eye tracker. You can drop a frame in and instantly shows you what user will notice first, like a heat map overlay that predicts attention. So you know if your CTA is doing its job, or everyone going to stare at the cute illustration instead. It's fast sanity check before you even run a user testing, and to be fair, I already used it to fix a few layouts that I thought were fine, but they weren't. Once your project is completed, you got to try this one. One of them turns any mockup into a skeleton loading screen or a placeholder layout with a single click. It's perfect for prototypes, especially if you want realistic transition or dev handoff files with a proper loading states. And the other is such a good style library. You can try completely different styles from liquid glass to 3D buttons across your whole file instantly. And if you work with multiple brands or just love exploring teams, this plugin will save you so much time. So these are my recent best finds and they absolutely gonna speed up your workflow. Let me know in the comments which plugin you're gonna try first. If you found this video useful, hit a like, subscribe and as always, see you next time. Bye!